Hi, this is Thomas from Mars Moon Space TV. I am back and I am looking at structures on the Martian service. I gave credit to Mr. Dressick for this one because he posted it on Facebook. Many others may have found it before him, but I choose to give Mr. the credit for this one. We're gonna get back to this one, but first we will have to look at what's on the top of this hill or mountain. Have a good look at this one, ladies and gentlemen. We are looking at buildings. We are looking at a base on Mars. And right now we are looking at the original JP2 image that we are zooming in. At. And here you see the three-sided pyramid that we were looking at in the beginning. We're gonna get back to that one at the end of this video. I want to zoom in on the area where there is buildings on. Because that is simply amazing. Here we have it. To me it's clear we are looking at buildings. You can see the roads between the buildings here. You can see the infrastructure. This is simply amazing. How much more proof do we need? Ladies and gentlemen, this is life on Mars. This is buildings on the red planet and it's caught on a photograph from Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter in 2007. So it's a 10 year old picture and here we have the first one we posted credited to Mr. Dresik for this one. We're gonna get back to that one later. Look at the buildings. Have a look at it. You can see as I said before the road uh, infrastructure uh, and it's simply an amazing and awesome picture. To me this is a proof of life on Mars, of infrastructure, of beings on Mars. Whoever those beings are, I don't know, humans, uh, other species, I don't know. But I see buildings here and I see a little village or a base. And I was speaking with uh, some good friends yesterday when Dolly and I were alive. And, and my good friend William White Crow that was uh, on board uh, with us on the, on the live stream. He used to work for the U.S. Army. He used to be, a, or he is a whistleblower. He has been uh, telling about uh, secret space programs and travel to Mars, etc., etc., etc. And the first thing that William said was, "You are looking at a base. This is what a base looks like from the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter." And I must admit that I am with William on this one. I have been looking on Antarctica for bases also and I have a list of 58 bases and I could take 30 of those bases, change the colors to gray and it would look exactly as what we are looking at here on the red planet, on the Martian surface. Ladies and gentlemen, building some Mars. Back to the uh, three-sided pyramid here. This is an awesome one. To me, it doesn't look natural, natural created. I could be wrong, I could be right, but this is an awesome anomaly that was pointed out by Mr. Dresik yesterday. And as I said before, many others may have found it before him, but I saw Misa post it, and this is the first time I see one, this one. So I choose to give the credit to Mr. Dresik for this one. How much more proof do we need on life on Mars? Until we see you again, take care, bye. They have depictions of the Anunnaki being inside of a craft, not just walking like a lot of them, but some of them are actually already in the ship, the little spaceship, and they're holding on to the bag inside the ship. Get out.